Hi, welcome to Ocean Time, I'm Pippa and today I'm talking about what drinks you can bring on board a cruise ship. This question comes up a lot of what drinks you can take on board. So I'm talking about Royal Caribbean International, which allows you to bring two bottles of wine or champagne or champagne and wine or two wines or two champagnes, but only two bottles you can take on board on embarkation day. You cannot bring beer, hard liquor. Now they state that you can't take soda, soft drink, pop or water. But there's some forums out there and some places where they do sometimes allow you. Worst case scenario, you get taken down to the naughty room and they confiscate it. If not, then... So just clarifying again, two bottles, wine or champagne, on embarkation day is totally allowed. Royal Caribbean have brought in a new corkage fee, $15 per bottle. This can work out to be cheaper if you have a nice bottle. So keep that in mind, only if you go to a restaurant with the wine. If you open your bottle in your cabin, there is no corkage fee. So you are more than welcome, take some bottles on board, have them in your cabin or open them in your cabin and you can walk around with the drinks. It's all fine. So I hope this has helped you. If it has, give me a thumbs up. If you have a comment for me, leave it below. I'll also put links to uh, Is the Drink Package Worth It? and the Royal Caribbean's Drink Package. So check those out below if you haven't seen them already as well. And thanks for being on board. See you later.